Hello friends. So after studying test organization and structure of testing group, test planning, we'll see about the test specification. Now what is test case specification? That means using the test planning, what we planned earlier, and the testing team's design test case specification. With which then becomes the basis for the individual test cases. Now they prepare the test cases. So test cases is according to IEEE format. They have one tabular format which says that it consists of serial number. Then you have the module name which is to be tested, the type of the testing procedures like type of the testing or testing type technique. Then you have expected output, ex, ex, uh, expected actual result and expected result. Then the remarks followed by that is positive or negative, pass or fail. So the purpose, the first thing, the test plan, the test case specification, it includes the purpose of the test and why I'm doing this test and for what I'm doing the test. So it also includes the scope of tests also. The features which are new and critical for the release, they are also tested. The item which is to be tested along the version or the release number as suitable. Then the environment that they need to be uh, set for the running of the test case. You have to define the environments in which they're going to produce those test cases. Then you have to initialize the input data. What could be the input data? And then you have to uh, identify the model on which you're going to put the test and what type of test you are doing on that module. Then the actual output and expected output or the actual result or the expected results are the same and if they are same then it is passed, if not they are failed and why they are failed you have to mention that. So the expected results that are considered to be the correct results. The step to compare the actual as I was telling before that a step is there to compare the actual and the expected is produced and then there is a reason returning that why they have been deferred or what are those defects that made, made them to be deferred. So this is the test case specification that this is in the writing of your test script. So next thing we'll see about the test, uh, testing metrics. Till then, study well.